All right, guys, so I can sum up the uh, Dragon Ball Super 127 in about a, a few a few words or less. But <laughs> no, guys, what what basically happened is uh, it's uh, Goku 17 and Vegeta against Jiren. And uh, Jiren releases this sort of volcanic um, energy around him. Where everybody literally says, "Oh shit! It looks like Jiren's on fire," and 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 everybody is basically saying, "Um, how finally Jiren's been taking taking this seriously," and even Vegeta points it out in in saying that um, it. It's a big mistake to wait this late in the game to take it seriously. A mistake you'll regret. Um, and then Jiren says, with, with the uh, punch that Vegeta gives him, he's like, I can see why you were able to beat Topo, but that, but that kind of cheap move won't, won't work on me. So, uh... Go Goku and Seventeen sort of think, or, or it's actually Seventeen that is finally able to uh, to uh, deliver a uh, chest blow to Jiren, which uh, rip, rips up his Pride Troopers uniform, but some, somehow he's he he's able to recover from it. Or it was an animation issue because. Um, Seventeen like last Jiren in the stomach. You you can see his uh part part of his stomach all bruised up, and then like five seconds later, um the the uh damage isn't there. So that gives the idea that either Jiren can re 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 recover from injuries, or the the animation was. Just a little weird in in that department, but um, after that, go go Goku Seventeen basically come up with a plan that basically Seventeen is to try and uh, get Jiren's attention, and then Goku and Vegeta are basically going to uh go go all out with a series of heavy attacks. In, in the hope in that that's what will eventually take care of Jiren. Now, um, Jiren, Jiren eventually says, all, all, all this is pointless, none of you are ever going to win, and then Frieza comes in with, with like this dynamic entry type of move and says, I'm not going to let you get away with beating me up this badly and making this much of a fool out of me. And, uh, Frieza even transforms into Golden Mode, but once again, Jaren almost makes, like, quick, quick work of Frieza as if he's, like, literally just a fly that, that's annoying the shit out of you, and for lack of a better word, guys, he once again knocks Frieza to the ground. And then, uh, the, um, and then the, uh, God of Destruction from the universe so I've been I still never learned how to pronounce this and so forget it guys, but he finally reveals um what Jiren's wish is um if he can get the super dragon balls and 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 the wish is just to increase his power. But we we do finally get to learn that when when Jiren was small, his 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 village and his family and even his master were were wiped out by this evil evil deer. And if I was reading the subtitles correctly, guys, it literally says an evil deer um so, somehow killed Jiren Jiren's parents, wiped out everybody from his village, and even after he trained for a number of years, um, w with the, uh, 
man that rescued him and ultimately became his master. Well, one, one, one June had to face the enemy again. He was still helpless to save his master. And that's when June decided that, um, that, 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 that the only true way, um, to, to get revenge is to get stronger so that kind of atrocity never happens again. So, um, so, so, uh, Jiren ultimately makes quick work of Goku, Vegeta, and Frieza, as I mentioned, and then Jiren almost del delivers the final blow to both Goku and Vegeta, but 17 makes the, uh, noble sac decision to sacrifice himself and take the full brunt of Jiren's attack, unfortunately destroying Android 17, but ultimately still saving uh, Go Goku, Vegeta, and Frieza. So yes, people, Android 17 is dead. 17 was destroyed by Jiren's attack. And uh, that's pretty much how the episode ends, guys. So again, a really honorable moment to us uh, to send Seventeen off with, and obviously, guys, when and if Universe Seven wins, that they, they they will use the uh, Super Dragon Balls to bring Seventeen back. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Keep on rocking.